The Bix gets its name from Bix Beiderbecke, a famous 1920s jazz musician from Davenport. And in honor of that, there is an, un, an event underway called the Heights of the Era. My co-host Morgan OTA joins us live from Lindsay Park in the village of East Davenport where Thody is getting underway. Hi, Morgan. Hi, Jake. This is an amazing event. It just started at 3 p.m. Uh, it goes until 10.30 tonight. You can hear the music behind me. Uh, they're playing some amazing jazz music out here, uh, Louis Armstrong song. And the view behind me is absolutely incredible here in Lindsay Park overlooking the Mississippi River. An awesome event. It just started. This is in its second year. Last year was popular uh, by the crowd that's filtering in this early on a Friday afternoon. I can tell this is also going to be a popular event. Uh, so you can kind of see a little bit behind me the way that this event is set up. Uh, the stage is actually in front of me right now. You saw that at the beginning of the show. Behind me are a lot of different tables and chairs. Uh, you can bring your own own chair you can bring your own food and drink and I have one of the actual musicians that is performing tonight uh, with us uh, we've got Abe Pollock and you are from the Sweet Tooth Jazz Band uh, you're based out of New York City yep New York City Brooklyn New York so that just goes to show you that uh, Michelle Russell uh, Jim Russell they set up uh, bands uh, Dixieland Jazz and bands from the 20s era from all over the United States. Um, you guys come from New York. Uh, we were talking a lot uh, off camera about the kind of music that you guys play. So explain it for the people that are thinking about coming out here tonight. Sure, well, uh, Bix Weekend is all about Dick Spiderbeck, one of your hometown heroes, someone who me and the guys really love. We love his music, um, which we call early jazz, traditional jazz. Um, so we're doing a little bit of that, but also we like a lot of blues and some rock and something just kind of makes you dance music from new orleans um so we're trying to mix all of that together and you know what La were you guys here last year so yeah. describe uh what it was like playing here for the crowd last year the very first year oh man it was so fun um great crowd people were seemed really into being outside and the sunshine and listening to fun. very hot last year <laughs> maybe they weren't too into the sunshine but definitely into <laughs> you know, coming out and hearing some good music. So yeah. we, we really enjoyed participating in that. Absolutely, there are multiple acts. Uh, uh, your band, of course, coming from New York, we've got bands from Chicago, from Minneapolis, um, all just with a really great addition to this Bix weekend. Uh, if you could describe, I mean, coming from, hailing from New York, what's, what's it like uh, being here in the Quad Cities, in the Heartland, and, and playing jazz music? Oh, lovely. I mean, this is the home of early jazz. Big Spiderbeck being from here all the bands from Chicago uh, that we looked up to. Um, you know, Louis Armstrong used to live in Chicago and play around here. Um, so a lot of the music that I love comes from this area. It's really nice to be here. Abe, thank you so much. Uh, we want to let everybody know, uh, while Heights of the Era is underway right now, it goes on until 10.30 at night, so you've got plenty of time. Multiple musical acts from different parts of the country. Uh, it can be tricky to park here in the village of East Davenport, especially later at night, but there is a shuttle service that is available. You can find more information by heading to the heightsoftheera.com. And uh, Jake, before I send it back to you, I want to let you know that yoga in the park starts at 4 p.m. The mayor will be speaking and after that there is plenty more music and fun to be had out here we'll send it back to you awesome morgan thank you also this bix weekend you can attend a special film screening about bix biderbeck it's a newly restored documentary that we'll learn more about